Good evening, William. Hello, welcome. Hello. Good evening, teacher. How are you? So, so, teacher. Why so, so? Hello. Hi, teacher. Why do you say so, so? How do you feel today? You feel better? More better, teacher. That's good, that's good. And tell me, how was your day? What did you do today? Uh, so rest all day, teacher. You still on vacation? Yes. Oh, that's nice. That's great. When does when do your vacations finish? Uh, Friday. Friday, this coming Friday? Yes. So you go back to work next Monday? Saturday. Saturday. Oh, that's weird. But just yes. half day or the whole day? What? You are going to go to work. Half the day or the whole day? On the whole day. Oh, well, anyway, that's the way it is. Yes. So, yeah, I know, I know, I know. I checked it out. So, you're doing better now. Yes. Excellent, excellent. That's awesome. Well, welcome to the class, William. Thanks, Tim. Hey, Janita, how are you? Hey, teacher. I'm really good. And you? Well, here, you know, another day. Okay. Today is better than yesterday because I feel so breezy. Well, actually, where I live, it's raining. Yes, it's a little raining. How, how is the correct form to say? Lloviendo poquito. Uh, a slight rain. Slight? Or perhaps, rain. or perhaps just a mist. Okay, just a mist. And I feel some breezy. It's, it's oh, yeah. nice. Yeah, it's cool. I like that. But even though I still got my fan going on. In, in San Martin? It's raining right now, but I have my fan turned on. Okay, okay. I turn so, off my 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 fan because I feel racy. I open oh. my, my window. Yeah, I can tell. I can tell you got your windows open and your curtains. Yes. Okay, and tell me, how was your day? What did you do today? Well, I had some cases and it was good. It was good. It was okay. a normal day. All right, that's cool. Tell me, did you have lunch today? Uh, I had lunch, but I don't prepare. Oh, I okay. didn't prepare. Who, who cooked for you? My mom, my mom cooked okay. for me. Okay, tell me, what did your mama prepare for you? Um, she cooked a uh, salt, meat, carne salada, oreada. Salt, yes, yeah, salt, salt meat. Salt meat, yeah. Do you like that? Yes, but she has a very good recipe for um 
remove uh, salt and only feel the, the, the flavor. It's a good, I, I like it. Oh, yeah, perhaps like that because the salt is not good for me. <laughs> yeah, but she used. Um, she uses. Your... Sorry? She uses. She uses uh, her recipe and yeah. it's good. It's good. I like That's it. Nice. I, I ate three tortillas. Oh, really? Wow. Yes, a lot. You got excited. Yes, and uh, I don't know, how do you say? Um, how do you say? How do you say uh, tomato with onion and rabano? Uh, radish. And radish? Um, how compliment that meat was was good. Okay, cool, excellent, excellent. That's in nice. a in a glass of soda. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, I oh. didn't drink a lot of soda, but today was good. Excellent, excellent. Well, thank you, Shanira, and welcome. Well, thank you, teacher. Hey, Walter, how are you? Walter, I don't hear you. Excuse me, listen to me. Yes, now I do. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. I am fine, teacher. Okay. How was your day? Oh, a day uh, in the company. Uh, uh, in the moment, uh, uh, my department in relax. Uh, uh, <clears throat> there are a little, a little boring. It was a little bit boring for you. Yes. Uh, uh, for the moment, yes, teacher. Uh, and todo genial. <clears throat> great. That's great. Yeah. Yes. Ah, okay. <coughs> For the moment, great teacher in my world, in my house. Uh, oh, and good. Very good. Okay. That's yes, excellent. Teacher. That's excellent. Great. Yeah, see, for the moment in my life, uh, I had no problem. <laughs> okay, wow, that's awesome. That's <laughs> awesome. Let's see. Well, thank you very much. Well, thank you very much, Walter. Nice having you here in class. Susana, hello. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you, Susana? Good evening. I'm fine. Thanks, teacher. Okay, tell me, what did you do today? I am working. <laughs> I am working. I am, I am or I was? Today. No, I am working. <laughs> Still working? Yes, teacher. Ouch, that's bad. But uh, finishing uh, a near, near finishing the month. Oh yeah, at the end of the month, some of you got a lot of work to do. Yes, teacher. Yeah, I Sorry. understand that. <laughs> I understand that. Well, but it's good to have you here in class. Nice. Okay. Thank you and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Elvia, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher, good evening. Good evening, how are you, Elvia? And um, um, very busy days. Busy days? Days. Why, the end of the month? 
and they out accumulate work. That's bad, that's bad. But the good thing is that you're now in class, so you can relax for a little while, get distracted of your work, at least for a little bit. Let's see, welcome to the class, Sylvia. Nice having you here. No, thanks to you. Okay, let's see, let's see who else is around. Marta, hello, Marta. Hello, teacher, good evening. Good evening, Marta, how are you? I'm good, and you, teacher? I'm just fine. Well, not that fine, but... What happened? Oh, a friend of mine passed away today. Oh, really? Yeah, and we are a little bit sad because of that, but you know, that's life. Same life, same history. Uh, so what about you? What did you do today, Marta? Uh, it was a very hard my day, teacher. I, I feel a little tighter, but I am ready for the class. Excellent, excellent. It's good to have you here. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank Nothing you, teacher. You. Let's see, Ambar. Hello, Ambar. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. What about you? I'm just great. You're ready to start the class. So tell me a little bit about yourself. What did you do today? Well, the same history. I work all day and I made chores in my house. Um, I have dinner at 6 p.m. Only that. The same routine every day. The usual stuff. Okay, well, that's nice. That's nice. Tell me, what did you prepare for dinner? Well, uh, um, how do you say pedicomina? Delivery, verdad? Yeah, I asked for delivery. Or I ordered. I, I ordered for delivery pupusas. Say what? You ordered for pupusas? Cool. Yes. That's nice. That's I nice. have a good pupuseria close to my house. That's excellent. Yes. Good to hear that. Thank you very much, Amber, and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Excellent. Excellent. Let's see. Let's see. Roxana, hello. How are you? Hey, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Ah, uh, bye. I guess. And you? Come on. How do you say I guess? What do you mean by that? You're fine. I don't know. I. Uh, it's complicated, teacher. Okay, I'm tired. Okay. Uh, I. I don't know. I feel a little sick. Oh, but that's bad. I'm so sorry to hear that. And what about you, teacher? Oh, well, you know, here, fine, just fine, ready to start the class. Another and day, another dollar. Yeah, another day, another dollar. That's the way I it is. Feel, I really feel like that. Yeah, you know, what else can we do about it? Yeah. So tell me, Roxana, did you prepare dinner? Uh, yes, I prepare milk with cereal. <laughs> cereal, cereal. Yeah. Okay, okay. that was, was not cooking. No, today no, no teacher. I I not feel, no, I didn't feel good in okay. the afternoon. Okay, I got an expression for you. Okay. I was not up, I wasn't up to it. I wasn't up, I wasn't up to it. Yeah, that's a modest. It means, uh, what it means is like, uh, I didn't feel like doing it. I didn't, I didn't feel, feel like if, 
I didn't feel like if I was able to do it. I wasn't in the mood to do it. No estaba de ánimos, no me sentía bien, no me creí capaz de hacerlo. All those ideas you express with that expression. I was not up to it. I wasn't up, como, espérame, lo voy a leer. I wasn't up to, to it. Yeah, I, I wasn't, wasn't up, up to it. it. Yeah. yeah. Today is a lazy day, I guess. A lazy I was working. Day? Yeah, oh, I that's was cool. working. But I I was a lot of have a lot of things to do. There were many things to do. They were a lot of things to do and I don't know, in the afternoon, I feel like, um, no sé cómo se dice en inglés, teacher, pero nosotros le decimos, bueno, yo a veces uso esa expresión, es como que la tarde se siente de bajada, como, no sé, no sé, no sé cómo explicarlo. ¿Qué significa? Como... ¿Slow? ¿Lenta? No, no, porque I was uh, working, I, I was, I had a lot of things to do. So, but I, I feel like the afternoon, it was, um, I don't know, complicated, weird. I don't know. So, and then like, just, I, I feel like a title, uh, a lot of uh, paint, I don't know. So I didn't, uh, no, no, yo no quise, I want, no. I didn't want to. I didn't uh, cook. Okay. That. That's why I didn't cook. That's why I didn't, I didn't cook, yeah. Perfect, thank you. I understand you completely. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that happens to me a lot. I never want to cook. <laughs> but in my case, uh, it's not a, um, no, it's an option. It's not a, it's not a, yeah, a it's, it's not an option. It's not an option. Yeah. It's complicated, but today I prefer meal with cereal. Nutritive. Okay, yeah, it is. It works. Yeah. That was my breakfast, actually. Let's see, yeah. Milk and cereal. Maybe it's my breakfast tomorrow, too. <laughs> yeah. And sometimes around midnight, I get a bowl of cereal with milk and I start like eating. You have I break. Yeah, sometimes at midnight, I do that. So you have uh, different uh, cereals. In my case, I I look for different cereals. Oh no! The situation in my case is that when it comes to cereal, I have a little problem. That for me got to be. Uh, how can I say this? Simple, tasteless. Cornflakes. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like uh, I don't like cereal like with flavor. Sweet cereals. No, 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 no. Wait. I sure. love Choco Crispy. My son loves Choco Crispy too. <laughs> but I have a lot of uh, cereals. Maybe four types of cereals. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, well, interesting. Thank you very much, Roxana. Okay, thank you, teacher. No, thanks to you. Thanks to you. Good to have you here. Now, let's see who else do I have here. Hey, Maria Alejandra, how are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. <laughs> Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm just great, just great. 
I've been like trying to get in my mind, trying to remember you from your days at school. <laughs> Maybe uh, you don't remember because you you don't you usted no me dio clases. Yeah, but I remember some some of your classmates. Melissa, Colocho, a todos ellos. Oh, yeah, I, I do, I do, I do. Eric. <laughs> it's just you, the one that is not in my mind. <laughs> because I knew in this moment I only study um, college or el bachillerato ahí. High school, high school. High, high school in Garcia Flamenco. Mm, maybe why. like this. <laughs> that must be the reason. Well, tell me, Maria, how how was your day? What did you do today? I the same all the days <laughs> when I work. <laughs> okay. Tell me, did you have dinner already? Uh, yes. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Okay, what did you have for dinner? Tell me. I ate um, beans, fried okay. beans. Okay. Um, okay. Um, I, I don't know, queso crema? <laughs> mm, me neither. That's cheese, but I don't remember the name of that specifically type, specific uh, type of cheese. Cheese what else? and plátano frito. <laughs> Plant, fried plantain. Fried plantains and uh, sanísimo uh, make a cookies, but uh, the flavor to tortilla. <laughs> okay. And only that. <laughs> hey, what did you drink? Coca Cola. <laughs> That's not healthy. No, but I don't know. My sister, me sirvió, como se diría? Served. My sister served my dinner and she put a paso, de, paso con Coca-Cola, sería? A glass with soda uh, or uh, a, glass, uh, a glass of Coke. Uh -huh. A glass with soda, and I don't have an option. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't, I didn't have, have an option. <laughs> okay, and I accept. Well, <laughs> that's cool. That's cool. Thank you very much, Maria. Welcome to the class. You're welcome, teacher. Okay, guys, let's see. Before I continue, I need to get the oopsie daisy. Hold on. I need to get the attendance. Today's attendance. Let's see. Let me just fix something here. Okay. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Eh, Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernández. Present teacher. Claudia Lizeth Ramos Barrientos. Present teacher. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Eduardo Daniel Noyola Brito. En caso de planificar la auditoría, supervisar oportuno y adecuadamente. El Bisonel Beltrán de Cabrera. Eh, Present teacher. Thank you. Hold on. Fernando Marvin Gonzalez Martinez. Present teacher. Thanks. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Hey, Francisco, not here. That's weird. Jose Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Present teacher. Thank you. Marta Navelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. 
Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Roxana Ibet Asensio de Mejía. Present teacher. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Thank you. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Thanks. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Yanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Francisco José Menéndez Aguilar and Linda Marlene Acosta Barrera. Okay, guys, let me continue because what I'm doing is an exercise. Actually, it's part of the of what we are going to be working with. Let's see, let's see, let's see who else is around. Mr. Osorio, hello, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. I'm <laughs> so tired. Tired? A hard day today? Uh, I had a, a pretty busy day. Oh, really? But what did you do today? Busy. Uh, busy. Busy. Uh, it was the, the beginning of, of production the, with first quality of uh, a group of uh, associates. And I must be aware of production and, and quality and many reports. But I'm ready for class now. Okay, that's good, excellent. I am glad to have you here in class. And tell me, did you have dinner already? Excuse me, teacher. Did you have dinner already? Yes. I'm just okay, finished. What did you have for dinner? Uh, of typical food. What you mean by typical food? Uh, like pupusas and, and a cup of coffee. Pupusas and a cup of coffee. Okay, that's nice. Yes. Just remember, you can tell me I have pupusas and a cup of coffee. Okay, I have pupusas and a cup of coffee. Had, remember, had. Had, had, excuse me, teacher. My Perfect. bad. Perfect. Thank you. I had. Thank you, Jose. Welcome to the class. Thanks to you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Hey, Carlos, how are you? Hey, teacher. Fine, teacher. Yeah. Uh, here, you know. Tell me, where are you? So, Yapango, who are you? No, oh, in the US. Okay, tell me, how's the weather there today? <laughs> the weather is raining. Actually, raining. Um, we have 21 degrees. 21 degrees? Yes. That's cool. Yes, teacher. So um, early, early in the early in the morning, it's going to be like twenty or nineteen, something like that. Yeah, usually uh, sometimes it's uh, around uh, seventy degrees in the morning at five a.m. For example, usually it's at seven, seventeen. Yes. That's cool. Tell me, what's yeah. the lowest? What's the lowest it has been there where you live? Um, the lowest, the lowest that, the, that you can remember. Lowest. Okay. The lowest. Lo más bajo that you can remember. Ah. When when I was a child, I I remember we have a. Uh, thermometer teacher. Ah, thermometer. Okay, we, we have a thermometer. And in a one, I, I, I saw the 15 degrees. in usually for, for me to December teacher. 
Um, I, I, I have a one, I think in one occasion, uh, when I just, when I just married with my wife. When I, when I was just married. Okay, when I was just married. Um, I remember I went to Coyua and uh, I lived for about uh, five years in San Salvador. When I went to Coyua and we went to the uh, dancing because in Coyua it's very common uh, the, how do you say? Paris, yes, the teacher. Paris, yeah, yes, Paris. A, yes, uh, in a in a party, and I wait. I how I don't know how do you say uh, amanecí. Stay up until early in the morning. Okay, I stay up until early in the morning. In the after the dancing. It really, really, really caught in that, in that opportunity. It was really cold. It was, it was really cold. Okay, well, interesting. Very interesting. Thank you, Carlos, and welcome to the class. Okay, thank you. Let's see. Wilfredo, hello, how are you? I'm fine, teacher. Tell me, Wilfredo, how was your day? What did you do today? I was, it was good teacher, a lot of busy, but it is occupational hazard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, it was, um, it was busy teacher because we have to, we have to get many information about the people that- A lot of information, a lot of information a lot of information um, about the people that don't have the first vaccine. Ooh. Yeah, because in the, comp the company is going to start to, to give, give it to the people this week and our, um, so my, pl my plan is going to have this day the next Friday. But we have to to give this information to the human resources. So the uh, human resource has to has to coordinate coordinate uh, to, uh, this activity. Oh, but, very interesting. Yeah, but so you've been busy today. Yeah, because um, every supervisor has around 100, 100 people, person. On charge, on charge. On charge. Uh, A cargo. Oh yeah, around charge. this quantity. Wow, but that is, A lot of people. It is, interesting. it is interesting because some people uh, some people told me that I want to get it. And when I ask him, ask, ask them, yeah. Yes. When I ask them, I, it is, uh, many people get that it is, it doesn't necessary for. It isn't necessary. Yeah, it is. Oh, but, really, well. Mm, but, yeah, 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 but it's a problem. It's a problem. Yeah, because I get the first dose that day. <laughs> I'm sorry. Today? Sorry. Did you get it today? I get the first dose that day, <laughs> Friday. <laughs> oh, ah, really? you are getting. I am getting. You're going to get. It? I'm getting. Ah, okay. I am getting the yes. first dose next Friday. Oh, ouch. what about you, teacher? How are you? Well, you know, now I was telling, uh, I don't remember who, everything was pretty good today, but a friend of mine passed away. So, you know, that's life. It was raining? 
No, no, I was telling you that a friend of mine passed away. In Santa Ana, it's raining around 6, 6 p.m. Since. Since. Six. Since. 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 Six. Yeah. Okay. Uh, can, can we... Can, you, can we use this word, teacher, when talking about the same day? Yes, yeah, sure. Okay. I've been here in class since 8 p.m. Teacher, excuse me. Okay. Yes, Jose? Uh, the meaning of pass away is when a, when a person dies. Yeah. Okay. That is... Well, thank you very much, Wilfredo, and welcome to welcome the class. Welcome, teacher. Great. Fernando, hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. Um, I'm a little tired. But oh, I'm really? Good. What did you do today? Uh, the usual. <laughs> the usual, but I'm tired. <laughs> you get like... <laughs> Only. You get yeah, like, no, nothing, <laughs> nothing special, so my work. Okay, well, it's the end of the month. Usually, oh, these yes. days are like harder. Yes, uh, yes, but uh, due to the the absence of my partner, all the all the month or uh, along the month, the whole month, the whole month, the whole, the whole. Okay, the whole month was. Yeah, you have been with overload. Overload, yeah. Yeah, okay, I can imagine. But, okay, now we are talking about dinner. Tell me, did you have dinner already? Yes, uh, some minutes ago. I, I, yes, I did. I yes, I did. Yes, I did. Okay. Yes, okay. I did. What did you have for dinner? I eat chicken. Ate? <laughs> I ate chicken. Okay, cool. Chicken How was your dinner. chicken prepared? Roasted, uh, fried. Fries? Fried soup. Okay. Fried chicken. chicken. Fried. Okay. So no, fried um, chicken. Fried chicken. Okay, fried chicken. Uh, this chicken, it was my lunch. But I have a <laughs> meeting at I had a meeting at eleven and and it was extended the more than expected. Yeah, so you didn't have and, lunch. Exactly. And I had uh, another meeting at 2 p.m. So I I did I did it. I didn't. I didn't eat. Oh. I didn't eat. Okay, uh, yeah. And that's it, in the afternoon I in the afternoon I ate some snack. Okay. Or, I had some snacks. I had some snack. Uh, teacher, uh, si digo, yo comí, uh, I ate or I did I eat. ate. I ate. I ate. Did is the auxiliary, but did is used just for negative and interrogative. Oh, okay. In affirmative, affirmative, no, in affirmative, you use the verb in past. In past. Ah, okay. I, in the afternoon, I have some snack. Okay. Or I ate. Why I have a not I ate? That's the way they speak. No, oh, okay. I have to. It's the, same, it's the same like when you are asking for the age. We say, uh, in Spanish, we say, yo tengo tantos años. In English, you say, I am, like I am 41 years old. You see, it's, it's just the way we speak. It's different. So in English, okay, you can so say, okay. I had, I took. I took. I had, I but it had in past. Yeah, because you are talking okay. about the past. I had. I had. H A H A D. Okay. Yep. Okay, well, I have some. No. And I took my lunch in the dinner. <laughs> at dinner. At dinner. At oh, dinner. for dinner. For no, I. I took my lunch for dinner. Yeah, for dinner. I'm sorry. For dinner. Okay. Perfect. Well, thank you, Fernando. And welcome to the class. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, where's Daniel? Hello, Daniel. 
How are you? Hi, teacher. I'm fine, and you? I'm just great, just great. Tell me, how was your day? My day was pretty good. We okay, were well, all the day was yes. with a lot of work, but at around 12, we have a visit to a place that we are offering and the, the contact, I don't know if the right word, contact, el contacto que tenemos. Yeah, the contact. Oh yeah, the contact tell us that the offer was accepted and maybe, uh, well, they say that, but she was in a little, uh, and a lot of different stuff. So we are waiting that uh, they sent us an email saying that the offer was approved. Okay. Told us, told us. It's in past, remember that. Told us. Okay. Told is the yeah. pass of tell. Okay. Yeah. Tell me, what time did you get home today? around well actually i was in home at, at home at, at home at around five but then i had to go out again because i before we get home we go to the supermarket we went to the supermarket and okay. they made a mistake Already? so we have yeah so i go to they have they have a cobrado cover charge they have charged three cereals and we only have two. Oh, so you have to go back yeah but oh. everything was uh, really nice. They have nothing. Uh, uh, always there simple. was there was no problem. Yeah, any problem? Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Excellent. Thank you very much, Daniel, and welcome to the class. Thank you. Let's see. Where's Sylvia? Sylvia, hello. How are you? Thank you. Tell me, Silvia, how was your day? Uh, it was good. Today I got to work at 7 a.m. At 7 a.m. Okay. Then I had lunch at 1 p.m. from 1 to 2. Then I finished work at 3. Um, I went with some of my co-workers to the beach like to walk and to eat something. It was oh. it was really good. Oh, nice. Isn't it today your Can day I... off, Sylvia? No, today is not my day off. Now my day off is on Thursday. Oh man, they change it. Yes, now it's like fixed. On, two, on Thursday yeah. is like uh, uh, my usual day off. Oh, interesting, interesting. Yes, interesting. And tell me, what did you have for lunch? For lunch, uh, I had pupusas. For, for lunch? lunch? Yes. My gosh. <laughs> I love, I just love pupusas. But I, I don't can eat, tell. I don't eat them like usually, sometimes. Man pupusas for lunch that's uh, <laughs> unthinkable for me i mean i cannot even thought on the idea of having pupusas for lunch that's incredible yes i know okay well welcome to the class sylvia thank you thank you okay guys now let me explain something today we are talking about simple past you remember yesterday we were talking about the past of the verb be. Today we are going to talk about the past of the rest of the verbs. And I was telling you that yesterday. If you remember, 
This is very simple because we already know simple present tense. When we talk about structure, it's the same. For the affirmative, the subject, the verb in past, and the complement. Just remember that there are regular and irregular verbs. The regular verbs, no problem. We just add ed at the end. We just add the ed at the end, and the verb changes from present, like the verb uh, walk, change to walked, right? But with irregular verbs, it varies a little bit. Why? Because when we are talking about irregular verbs, those verbs change. Like we have um, go, the verb go, that turns into went. Those are irregular verbs. The irregular verbs got a different form for their past. Now, something that we must remember is that simple past tense got an auxiliary. Which is the auxiliary? What is the auxiliary of simple present? Do you remember? I'm sure you do. The auxiliary for simple present is the verb do. Do or does, right? That we use for negative and interrogative. Like, I don't, I don't usually have dinner very early. Okay? That's the auxiliary. But, when we are talking about simple past, the only thing we do is change do for did. What is did? Did is the past of do. That's why I was asking you, uh, what did you have for dinner? What did you do today? You see, as we get the auxiliary did, the verb goes in present. Did you have dinner already? What did you have for dinner? Those were the questions I was using. Do you remember I was asking you, what did you have for dinner? That was the question, okay? As you can see, you got the auxiliary deal and the main verb, the verb have, in present, okay? The verb have in present tense, in the base form, okay? Now, let's go to the manual because we got there a short conversation that we are going to discuss and analyze a little bit, okay? Let me share the screen with you guys. Okay, we got a conversation here. Remember, this is the manual. We are in page number 39 in the manual, okay? And the conversation goes like this. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding? Who were the speakers? Uh, let's see, Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Ms. Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You are right. I repeat, guys. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes. I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. 
many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Uh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Zanini from Brazil. I love Miss Zanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. I will repeat one last time, guys. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding? Who were the speakers? Uh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Ms. Zanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Okay, guys, let's go to the practice. Let me just check a little something with the groups. Okay, groups are created. Please jump in for minutes. But I don't hear you. <laughs> you hear me? Yes, in my house okay. it's rainy. Uh, yeah. Okay. Esther. Hey, Lorna. How are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lorna, yes. I did. The training was awesome. Come on, Janina. Was... You can tell, hey, Carlos. Instead of saying, hey, Lorna. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> you <laughs> say that we don't change the name. <laughs> Come on, you can change them. That's not a problem. Okay, okay. okay. Tell me everything about it. what is difficult. Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Uh, Hello, guys. Hello, teacher. You're, you're on your own? My partner. Uh, my partner ha 
have some problems. Okay, let's do it. I will start. Hey, Jose, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Excuse me, teacher. Excuse me, wait a moment, please. Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding? Who were the speakers? Uh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Zanini from Brazil. I love Miss Zanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You are right. Okay, now let's see. Yes, yes. You start. Okay. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? To say, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about this. Excuse me, teacher. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Um, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. Hello, Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Okay, I'll go check in the rest of the groups, okay? Okay, thank you, teacher. No, oh, thanks to you. Andrew Johnson from, and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Okay. Hey, hey Lorna, how are you? Ah, uh, yes. Okay, now it's my turn. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Let's see. Andrew. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You are right. Okay, well, I'm sorry to interrupt, guys. Fernando, I got 10 minutes for you tonight. Are you going to okay. stay? Yes, teacher. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. you. Okay. Okay, one minute and we go back, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay. Okay, Maria, you start. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lorna, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was as at the new hotel.
Okay, let's see, let's see who's gonna be first. Now I got Maria Luisa. And Wilfredo. Maria Luisa is available? No. Teacher. You were I, alone, Wilfredo. Okay, no problem. No, I Wilfredo. practice. I, I, I was with um, Claudia. Okay, sorry. <laughs> okay, with Claudia. Perfect, let's do it. Okay. Will you start, Claudia? Okay. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Uh huh. Yeah, I did. The training was a reason. It was at a new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was this difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it wasn't very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Um, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was a free international CAO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Okay, perfect. Very well done. Now let's see, Carlos Antonio and Janira. Who's that? You, Janira, thank you. Okay. Hey, Carlos, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Janira, yes. I did it. I, I did, the training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. So great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding? Who were the speakers? Oh, uh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Okay, perfect. Both of you, very well done. Let's see, Roxana and William Rosales. Who was the teacher? Let's see. Mm -hmm. William, you start, please. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about what is difficult. Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Oh. I think we had a problem there. Well, here, there. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Repeat, please, Roxana. Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? How? Let's see, Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Mr. Sanini. She was the first international CEO of the business and world company two years ago. You are right. Perfect. Excellent pronunciation, William. Now let's see, Daniel Eduardo and Susana Beatriz. Daniel, you'll start. Okay. Hey, Lorna, how are you? 
Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was in the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, I wasn't that mm. difficult, but I was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Ut, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Mrs. Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. Yes, all right. Okay. Many international speakers came. Came, Susana. Many Let's see. International speaker came. Okay, thank you. Amber and Sylvia. Amber, you'll start. Okay, give me one second, please. Hey Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Um, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Perfect pronunciation, both of you. Excellent. Elvia Janet and Marta Morales. Elvia Jules Tart. Okay. Hey, Lorna. How are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. So great. But tell me. Tell okay. me, tell me everything about what is difficult. Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speaker? Uh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Mrs. Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Marta, hotel, hotel. Hotel. Okay, now let's see Fernando Gonzalez and Maria Alejandra. Fernando, you'll start. Okay, teacher. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. What is difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Oh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You are right. Okay, hold on. No, everything was okay. Now let's see. Jose and Maria Luisa. Maria Luisa, you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, Jose, you start. Yeah. Okay. 
Yeah. Hey, How are you? Uh, did you attend the training last week? Lana? Yes, I did. The training was, I, I was on, it was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very ch challenging. Many international speakers came. Okay. No kidding. Who for the speakers? Oh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Saini from Brazil. Oops, I think this is having trouble. I love Miss Anini. She was the French international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You are right. Perfect. I'm sorry, Jose, but I think you're having problems with the connection. Let's see, guys. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay. I need to get attendance again. Sorry. But you know how it is here. Just a second. Let's see. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present teacher. Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernandez. Present teacher. Claudia Lizeth Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present. Edward Ademir Noyola Brito. Present. Elvia Chanet Beltrán de Cabrera. Present. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Present teacher. Marta Navelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present teacher. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present teacher. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Shanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Francisco José Menéndez Aguilar. And Linda Marlene Costa Barrera. Okay, let me just check on something. Perfect. Now, let's see, guys. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Hmm. Let's go check on something else. Just give me a second. Okay, here we are. Perfect. This is just a short review for you. Because this is something that we were checking out yesterday, right? Use the past of be to talk about situations in the past. I, he, she, it. We use was. Do you remember? We, they, you. We use were. Affirmative statements, the training was very helpful, all the employees were happy to attend. Negative statements, it was not difficult, it wasn't difficult. We were not unwilling to help, we weren't unwilling to help. Now, I think we don't have problems with the pass of the verb be, right? 
Okay, now let's see. We also need to review a little bit of something else, but we are going to do it here in the board. Okay, simple past. Now, something that we must remember is this, guys. Not just the structure. Remember, whenever we are talking about a tense, it's important that we remember the idea we express. Okay, so the simple past, it is used to express an action that is finisher, okay? Finisher. This is very important. We need to remember this. Whenever we are using simple pass, we are talking about an action that is finisher, okay? Like uh, I, I have fries for dinner. Okay, I have French fries for dinner. Like Maria Alejandra also had French fries for dinner. That was in the past, okay? No more. Now, something else that we need to remember. Okay, that's the structure. Simple past, we remember that. The simple past, uses deal as an auxiliary for, and this is very important to remember this guys, for negative and interrogative form, okay? We use did as an auxiliary for negative and interrogative form. What else shall we remember? Okay, there's something else. I go mass. Now, let's remember that when we are talking about simple past, guys, we have regular and irregular verbs. Okay, when do we use regular and irregular verbs? Ah, that happens when we talk about the affirmative form. For the affirmative, we use the the past of the verbs. Okay, now. For the affirmative, we use the past of the verbs, but there's a little detail here. Which is that detail? Okay, the detail is this. If you remember something that I was explaining right at the beginning of this activity was that regular verbs, oops, sorry. I was telling you that regular verbs just add ed at the end of the verb to form their past, okay? Example of this. Okay, an example will be, you see, we got walk. And if you see, this one turns into walked. Another one. Let's see, play. Turns into play. Okay, but that's with regular verbs, okay? Let's remember that. Regular, they just add ed 
at the end of the verbs. Now, but we have a little problem with irregular verbs. Okay. And irregular verbs are a little bit different. Okay. When we talk about irregular verbs, it's important that we remember. Irregular verbs have their own form to express their past. Oops. Examples of this will be, you remember I told you, go turns into went. We got verbs like run that turns into ran. Come came do deal make made and so on and so on. Any question up to here? No? Okay, perfect. No, Let me just let me just send you a shot of this, okay? Okay, guys, I just sent you a picture of this. Can I erase? Okay, now, structure. Basic structure. Remember, when we talk about basic structure, we are talking about the most simple sentence. If you remember, we have always said that when we are talking about tenses, we got three different forms, okay? Remember, we have the affirmative form, right? Affirmative form. But when we are talking about sentences, it's also important that we remember there's also negative form. We also got negative form. And the last one, of course, all of you know, it's the interrogative form, right? When we talk about sentences, Tenses, uh, remember, everything can be expressed just affirmative, negative, or interrogative. Now, for each one of them, there's a basic structure. We are talking about the minimum of elements that they should have in order to turn into a sentence. Now, the structure for the affirmative form very simple. The affirmative form for the simple past, remember we are talking just about simple past, is subject plus verb. And remember, the verb in this case, oops, my bad, the verb is in past. The verb is in past clause. Whoopsie. Clause complement. As simple as that. Example of this will be okay. Something very simple. And we get I played. Soccer yesterday. Simple, no? Now, for the negative form, how do we do the structure? 
again, when we go to the basic structure for the negative form, it's quite simple. Okay. The structure for the negative form, in this case, we must pay attention because we start using the auxiliary. We got the subject. plus the auxiliary that in this case is did plus not plus the verb and pay attention the verb in present the base form okay plus complement okay what does it mean oh it means this look the same sentence we turn it into negative i did not or i didn't contract it i did not play soccer yesterday as simple as that. You see, subject, auxiliary, not, the verb in present, complement. Now, the interrogative form, of course, the structure for the interrogative, it's quite simple. What do we do here? Let's look at the structure. Auxiliary plus subject plus verb again the verb in present in the base form okay plus complement plus oops question mark so that means that this sentence turns into Look at the sentence. Did I play soccer yesterday? You see, it is very simple. Any question up to here, guys? No, teacher. Okay, just let me get a picture for you guys. So everybody got, got it there. Oops, a second, let's see, let's see. I want it to be clear. Okay, there you go. You can get a screenshot, it's even better. Can I go back to the... To the main room. Yes. Okay. Questions. No questions. Simple pass is very simple, right? And this is just a review. You already you have already seen this. Now let's go and do a small exercise, okay? Where we are going to apply it. It's always better when we practice. I think it's more like positive. Yes, Walter, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. You were telling me to share the images. I shared both of them, okay? Let's see. Okay, look, we got a paragraph here. And the, the activity five from page number 40 says, read the paragraph below and answer the questions. Mary went to a training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment she uses and how to prevent damages on it. The presenter was really helpful and he clarified all doubts Mary had. He used a computer to present examples during the speech. Now we got us here 
six questions that we have to answer. Question number one, when was the training? I'm sorry, question number one, how was the training? Number two, when was the training? Number three, did you like it? Number four, what did you learn? Number five, was the presenter helpful? Number six, did he use examples? Okay, imagine that you are Mary. You are answering these questions, pretending you are Mary, okay? And using the information that appears on the box. For doing this short exercise, I will give you four minutes. I will get you into small groups so you can practice together and let's do it fast. Four minutes, we start right now. Please jump in. Okay. Hello, Walter. Hello, hello. Hello. Uh, number one. And uh, uh, for me is uh, the training, the training was interesting. 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 Hello, Mr. Fernando. What? Interesting. Yes. Oh, let's see, Francisco. Hello, teacher. Do me a favor, say present, Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejia. Yes, sir, present. Thank you. <laughs> it needs to be recorded, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, interesting. Uh, number two, when was the training? Okay, you... veamos. Esa es la fecha, ¿cuándo fue? ¿Cuándo fue? Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. How, how was... How to fix equipment? How was, how was the training, number one? Oh, it was interesting. Como estuvo? I think it's she learned interesting. how to fix the equipment. Number one, number one, question number one, Carlos. Question number one says, how was the training? Okay, that means, uh, it was, was it training. good, it, was it bad? Interesting. Interesting. In this case, yes, in this case is, it was interesting, okay? Okay. okay. Really helpful. Did okay. he use examples? Let's see. Ah, no, he this group a... doesn't want me here. You don't need me, guys. I'm gone. 
Guatemala. 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 Did you like it? Did you like it? La historia, pero ni el ¿Cómo? Se le gustó, creo que sería. Did you like it? Yes. Yeah, exactly that. Did you like it? ¿Te gustó? Yes, I like it. Yes, I liked it. Remember, you need to add a D, okay? Ah, okay. Because it's in past. Or you can say, you, yes, I did, or no, I didn't. Use ED and when I use I, he, she, Cambia para plural la regla o no? No. No, in this case, in past, no changes. Oh. The training was interesting. Okay. And the number two, the training was in Guatemala. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, correct. Did you like it? Yes, I liked. Yes. Uh, the pronounce like, like, or like it. Like, with like. T at the end. Exactly, T. Yanira. Like, yes. Light. Okay. It sounds t as a T. As a T. Okay, get it. It, well, ED after K, okay? Okay, only after K. Yep. Okay, light, light. Okay. Number four, what did you learn? I learned, in that case, teacher, learned. I learned, learned. Learned. Like that, perfect. Uh, Sounds like D, learned. Yep. Okay. I learned how to fix the equipment. Yes. Four and five. Was the presenter helpful? Yes, he was. Mm -hmm. Number six, did he use example? Yes, he did, only. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Carl, oh, you're welcome. You look very thankfully, teacher. Thoughtful, thoughtful. Thoughtful or thoughtfully? Thoughtful. Okay. Some people. Yeah, as I told you guys, uh, a friend of mine passed away today. What? I'm sorry. One of one your friends 
pass away. Yep, today. Oh, it is so. And uh, the biggest problem is that we are trying to, because he didn't live close, so we are trying to find out with some friends where is he going to, where is going to be the funeral. Oh, yes. Yeah. Sorry yeah. for you, teacher. Yeah, you know, the problem is that he used to live here in my neighborhood, but then he went uh, somewhere else. Uh, actually, I saw him one week ago. He came over and we had lunch together and everything. But now, I mean, I found out through, through, through Facebook, to the, to the social media, through social media that it happened. He was... Uh, he was a mechanic and he was also a racer. He used to race in first in Javali and then in Singwil. Oh yeah. So he was close and it's bad, very bad. Oh, yes. But it, was an, an, was an accident or was a COVID? I don't well, I'm sure that it wasn't COVID because he had that before. Eso ya le había dado. Okay, but you can repeat this sick illness. Illness. Yeah, but we are trying to find out because we don't have that much information. Yes, it's really difficult because I I have news that somebody died. And the hospital said that uh, she 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 had a COVID, but I don't know. I saw I saw the last week and two weeks ago, and I don't know. Maybe no. And the hospital yes. all say it's COVID, but it's not true. Yeah, it's very complex, and you know that's life. Yeah, and everybody is like. Everybody's like talking about it. So think about it all day, teacher. Yeah, actually, all all the afternoon we've been like on it, but we cannot get communication with some of his relatives. That's the problem. Mm. Yeah, this is a problem because you don't know yeah, nothing. But, yeah, but tomorrow morning I will for sure. That's a fact. Okay. I'll go visit some of his relatives to find out. Well, let's see, guys. It's time. Let's go back. Okay, teacher. Hey, I mean. Hey, Roxana. Oh, yeah, Roxana. Ya vino el teacher, ya no digamos. She's come, teacher. Yeah, she came to class, you know. Ni modo. Anyway, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Teacher. Yes. When you say anyone, like uh, Nimodo. Yeah. Anyway. Ah, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay. We got, we got us five questions. How was the training? When was the training? Did you like it? What did you learn? Was the presenter helpful? Did he use examples? Now, guys, uh, those questions, you already answered about the, about the, 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 the script, but now I'm going to jump into a different activity, okay? And let me explain to you what the activity is going to be about. You're going to ask 
your classmate those questions, okay? Like Fernando, I get with Fernando and I start asking Fernando, hey, Fernando, uh, well, first, I'll, I will ask him, when was your last training? The last training, it was the last year. Okay, how was the training? It was boring. <laughs> when was the training? Sorry? When was it? Uh, it was um, December 2020. Or when? When? Or where? What it was. Not the question, teacher. When or where? When? When? Uh, okay, when? Yes, December 2020, last year. Okay, perfect. So you see, I am asking him the questions. I need you to go into the groups and start asking those questions, okay? Just one person is going to ask and the other is going to be answering, okay? So groups are created. You are going to be working with somebody else, somebody different. Let's go, let's do it. Elvia. Hello. You alone. Hello. Okay, no problem. I will send you to a group. Tell me, what, what do you want to know? The first one. How was the training? How was the last? Yeah, how was your last training? My last training. My last oh. training was in, was the last year? At the end of the last, last year. Of the you last don't year? need to say the last year. It was the last year. Yes, it was last year. It was last year. It was last year. Yep. What about you, William? Very good. When was the last training? Siempre sería como el relato de la... It was. ¿Cuándo fue? Ajá, pero es del párrafo nosotros. No, 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 your, your. It is about your information. Oh. Ok. Eh, eh, maybe eh, is internal audit preparation. Okay, and was the presenter help, helpful? In, was uh, the presenter helpful? Uh, teacher, uh, was, yeah, in, in español, esa parte no la entendí, la de the helpful. Helpful. Eh, le ayudó, fue atento, estuvo disponible para ayudarle. El presentador, el speaker. Mm. Ah, okay. Teacher, uh, in the case, 
is the training is online. Yes. Eh, eh, aplica igual. <laughs> yeah, look, this is a training. This is a training in English. Okay, I am the presenter. Am I being helpful for you? Yes, yes, teacher. Okay, I was worried. <laughs> I won't even ask Silvia. Silvia will be like, oh. <laughs> no, teacher. You're really helpful. Okay, guys. I'm going to go check other groups, okay? Any questions? Okay. Uh, my, in my case, only teacher. <laughs> okay, only perfect. Oh, really? Teacher, finish. Finish? <laughs> Oh, that's Estamos cool. That's cool. <laughs> well, as long as you do it in English, Maria Alejandra, no problem for me. Mm, Always. Okay. Always. I try. <laughs> it's mandatory. And then you pay attention and at the finish, uh, you present a test. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's true, teacher. I I talked with Carlos about my training. We receive the same training each three months. The same. They every only, three months. Every three months. Okay, every every three, three months. They only change some a uh, picture on the slide, but it's the same. Then it's boring. That's yeah. good. So that means that you got it memorized. Okay. All that information you got it like in the stone. Yeah, I, I know, but, but they never change. Uh, tends to be boring. The content. Yeah. Maybe maybe you need a change where the speaker. Yeah. No, if you need a where the speaker, man, that would be interesting. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> I, I'm a master in security of information too. Then That's why. My then my, my presentation was very interesting. Will be, will be. Will be very interesting. Hey, Carlos, you ready for the homework? No, teacher. <laughs> Come on, don't skip class. You cannot skip class, Carlos. I am counting you every single minute. You are connected. Okay. Estoy contando hasta el último minuto para que me le dé. Ok, so you cannot skip class. No se me vaya a perder. Ok, teacher. Ok, let's go back to the main room. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, let's see, for tomorrow I got Carlos. No, for Thursday. Who else did I have for Thursday? Veamos, perdón, voy a cambiar el español en un momento. ¿Qué más tengo asignado para el jueves en actividad? Mencioné Me. Carlos. Carlos, María Alejandra. Daniel. Daniel. Daniel, <risa> Fernando, thank you. Carlos, María Alejandra, Daniel, Fernando, en Yanira. Yanira, you also go for Thursday. 
And Marta, who, Thursday, Carlos, Maria Alejandra, Daniel, Fernando, Janira, and Marta. Teacher, disculpe una pregunta. Yes. Hey, teacher. Sobre qué es la actividad? Uh, like you are making a small commercial. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Now, Friday. For Friday, I got Elvia. Okay. William. Susana. Wilfredo. Edward. And Carlos. It is from Friday, and, teacher. Yes, in your case, for Friday. And the rest of you go for Monday. Okay. When the class is finished. Yep. Now, the okay. last day of class. Okay. Teacher. Yes. On, in, on vacation, uh, have. have have the, the, the class, English class. I'm sorry. Que si tendremos clases en vacaciones. Monday, we finish next Monday. Terminamos el lunes. Todo el lunes. Ah, only, only. Yes. <laughs> teacher. That, teacher. By the way, did you send your paperwork? Did you turn in your paperwork? Ya enviamos los documentos. Okay, perfect, perfect. Teacher. Yes, Amber? I have a question uh, about the yesterday homework. I think that a um, mistake in one item. Which one, Amber? The, um, the yesterday homework, I I don't remember the number is 15 or let's see yesterday was the beginning of unit four right yes then no sé si yo lo estoy llenando mal pero no me no me agarra una de las respuestas oh number two uh -huh. sí. They fixed it already. Ya lo arreglaron. Yes. Ok, lo voy a revisar entonces porque así lo intenté hacer hoy en la mañana y no me parece. Yeah, it fixed. Ok, thank you. You're welcome. Ok, guys, by the way, uh, just to remind you, because it's almost time, just to remind you, please, you need to finish the platform. And also to remind you that uh, tomorrow you are getting, you are receiving the email with information about the, what you call it, uh, the, 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 la nota de satisfacción, la encuesta. Recuérdense, esa la hacemos juntos el último día, ¿ok? Así que no me la vayan a hacer antes, me esperan porque siempre vamos a ir paso por paso. Como siempre, yo con gusto les ayudo, ¿ok? Let me just get the final attendance. Dejemos solamente tomar la asistencia final, please. Ambarelli Alfaro Gómez. Present teacher. Carlos Antonio Morillo Hernández. Present teacher. Claudia Lizette Ramos Valencia. Ramos Barrientos. Present teacher. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Eduardo Ademir Noyola Brito. Present teacher. Elvia Chanet Beltrán de Cabrera. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. 
María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Presente, teacher. Marta Navelinda Morales de Portillo. Presente, teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Presente, teacher. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Yeah. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Yanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present. Francisco José Menéndez Aguilar. Linda Marlene Acosta Barrera. Okay. Thank you very much, guys. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye bye. Good night, teacher. Good See night. you tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Bye, 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 bye guys. Bye. Good night. Hi, teacher. Hello, mister. How are you? I'm fine. I'm, I'm tired. Always I'm tired. Uh, <laughs> but I'm fine. I can imagine. I can imagine. So, how's everything? Tell me, is everything clear about the topics, vocabulary, structures? Yes. Uh, the last class was interesting and it very, very clarified. Oh, yesterday. Yesterday, today. Okay, that's good, that's good. For tomorrow, I'm going to prepare a, a PowerPoint again with the full explanation of the simple past and more exercises. Okay, it's, this dynamics, I like it very much. Okay, excellent. And how are we doing with vocabulary? Do you want more vocabulary? Uh, yes, yes, I, I want. Okay, let me see, let me see. Let's see. I'm going to show you something. I don't know if I show you the vocabulary that you can get from the English Cooperativo app. Okay. Are I showing it to you? No, right? No, se la había no. Mostrado, ¿verdad? no, no, no. Okay, let's see. Here we go. We got the platform, right? All right. Okay. If you go down here, you see Centro de Ayuda. Okay. You come to Centro de Ayuda. And you come right down where it says Recursos Académicos. You got grammar, pronunciation, vocabulary, and video conferences. You see? Yes, I see. So if you want vocabulary, it opens the blog where you can see, look, Everyday oh. activities, personal care products, household cleaning and laundry outside the home. And there's a lot. Okay, it's, uh, there is an order. Yep. The, the number. Yes, you see, there are like 53 of them. Okay, interesting. Yeah, and I mean, you can get a lot of information right there. Okay, and that's know. that's just vocabulary, but you can also get grammar, look. Grammar. Oh, grammar, it's complicated sometimes. You got basic, intermediate, advanced grammar presentations. Okay. Okay, I, I will check. I will check and I will download. And I will read. Yeah, I mean, that could be helpful for you because uh, as far as I can understand and as far as I can get it through, the, through your conversations and everything, I mean, you got a good command of the English. Mostly what you need is practice because you got the structures, you got vocabulary, but sometimes I think that the specific word slips out of your mind. Yes, in the, in the, in the moment, in the correct moment. <laughs> yeah, and that happens, that happens. But the important 
thing here is for you to keep on practicing. And those exercises that are there can help, can be very helpful. And as you can see, I mean, that's the English Corporativo platform. So that's information that it's related. Also, you can review the, you can review the manual. Remember the manual, actually these manuals are very good because you get vocabulary specific focus on the, the, the working environment. Yes. Yes. I and heard. that's that's not something that you usually get in regular courses, right? Right. Because I mean, in regular courses, you don't talk about human resources. You don't talk about uh, about uh, well uh, everything that we are watching right here. Yes. Yes. And I. I. Lo he notado. I have noticed. I have noticed. Noticed. I have noticed, I have noticed the manual is, is specific about, about, yeah. about uh, work it's area. Job, yeah, exactly, it's job related. And it's good because I mean, that's actually some of you, like in your case, you are so immersed in your job that you will need that vocabulary to, to, to use it like in an everyday basis. Um, uh, and my work yeah perhaps if you had the opportunity to talk to somebody about that you will need that vocabulary because in some areas the manuals are very technical uh, yes in, in my case uh, only documents documents are oh. in english oh so uh, you gotta read yes yes um i i said you last time I understand more read that yeah. I speak. That's normal. That happens to everyone. Yes. Um, but I, I have practice still. I have I have. Yeah, I have practices. No, I've been practicing. I've been practicing to um I've been practicing in, in an app. Oh, that's great. In an app okay. called it. Kate. Yeah, I know the, that one. It's good that you got the opportunity to practice more and more and more, and you can you can reach out for different type of information, specifically related to your area. I mean, there's a lot of information about technology, and that's your area, yes. right? Uh, yes, there's a lot. And also, uh, it's good that you get the chance to practice vocabulary related to different areas of the working environment. Because we don't know, I mean, you are in this company, but perhaps then you can have an opportunity, a better opportunity and jump to a different position perhaps in your company. And perhaps you will need more vocabulary. Yes, English always, like the people say, English open doors. Yeah, I mean, all languages, they help, they are helpful. So what I will recommend you, check those exercises, check those spaces that I just show you. And okay, let me with. know if they are useful or not. If they are not, I will look for more information so I can help you out, okay? Okay, teacher, I will. I know that you are tired, mister, and I really appreciate that you stay here for a few minutes with me. Have a good night. If there's not any other question, if you have any other question, tell me. Uh, no, for, for the moment, no. Okay, at the moment, at the moment. At the, mo at the moment, at the moment, no. at the moment, no. okay. okay. I will check the, 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 I will check the platform and I don't know, uh, más adelante. Further on, further on. Further on. Further. Yeah. Uh, further, further on. Yep. F U R T H E R. Further. Yeah, further. Okay. Further on. I we will you. see. Okay, perfect. I will be here waiting. Okay, teacher. Thank you for. Have for a good all night, your No, no, no. no. It's a pleasure. Okay. Okay, night, teacher. Bye.
Okay, well, this is how we finish today's class. It was very interesting. Let's hope everybody gets connected tomorrow for the activities. It's going to be nice tomorrow also. We will have a lot of fun and it's getting interesting and interesting this class. So I hope everybody enjoy today's. Tomorrow we are going to be working more and more. There's a lot of stuff to cover and we are almost finishing with this module. So that's it for tonight. Thanks to everyone who was connected. Thanks to everyone who takes the time to check and check again those videos. It's very important that everybody practices. So have a good night. See you later.